fact, when these teams meet for league points nine games into the season, the two line of Milan, McKenney and Weyer of Juventus. Side of the halfway line, now Stuart Robson alongside me is a keen student. But this should be a very competitive game. In the recent meetings growing in number. being frozen out and he hasn't even traveled well it looks like a strong back three with get integrated three of their new recruits do start however Pulisic and Loftus a lot of the attacking threat will come from the left Hernandez loves to get forward from his fullback position Olivier Giroud at the tender age of 36 now his league final won by Milan in Manchester on penalties Calabria offside Pulisic so that's not going to count but a good start for Pulisic. Have a good understanding. Where? And he followed through. And the new man, Tijani Reinders. Here he two points more than Milan last season. Neat feet from Moretti. Cambiasso. Now from Villarreal, so three into two doesn't go. Well, Leal. Whenever I've seen him play, has always played on the left-hand side. That's his favourite position. Running with the ball, coming in on his right foot and getting shots away, playing little one-twos. He tries to get Juve moving. Federico Gatti. Milan side who finished last season strongly in terms of their league play. One defeat in their last 11. Suffered the defeat of the semi-final exit to their local of rivals Inter Again, see how deep the defenders are defending here Hernandez guiding it well out of the reach of Wojciech Szczesny The seven times champions of Europe have their noses in front. And all the co. Miretti. Position for Ware, who is quick, as we know, very quick. It's Chiesa! on Miretti strong play by Miretti now free and Chiesa so this will be Chiesa on by McKenny and scrambles off the line first of all by Krunic Returned with interest. Juventus have a very scrappy equaliser. And it is the former Manchester. This talk of maybe Kessie. Yeah. Well, we saw in the second half of Barcelona against Arsenal last night coming into the club. It's a similar sort of player. Ruben Loftus cheek. Yes. So we are penultimate week of the season. Of May has settled in Milan's favour that game by a classic centre forwards header from Olivier Giroud. That's Pulisic. It's Tiao and Giroud. They look for a flag. There is no flag, and Milan have their lead back. Well, they're all claiming offside. Locatelli. Ruin intensity and competitiveness. Need to resume and so we can get back underway. Stay out there as the holding midfield player. It's clear for the referee, Tim Ford's liking.
Reigns fired in. Deflected on Roach. Rogani is going to take the plaudits. And it's taken barely two minutes of the second half for Juventus to level for a second time. And once again, Milan don't defend it particularly. from his right wing back position they have a whole group of are the players that are eligible to come on for Milan I should just point out that as well as that caption that we showed you there has been a, a changing goal for Juventus Left footy players here, Giroud, Teo Hernandez, Florenzi, Alexandro. Part, it's pretty much all changed. Here's where Keane. Clear indication of the priorities of the two. In the centre, but Batasagi, the Milan defender, cuts it out. Kostic, Milik. He's one of the more promising young players for Milan. He played a couple of games. Others would say he wasn't quite fierce enough. Sunday in Las Vegas, Manchester United against Dortmund. That's the interesting role. Bây giờ mình cũng sẽ cắt.